block up to my feet, hurt the slayer, yeah, yeah. better yeah. off work to the good, I don't pay, yeah. yeah. I don't took a ride in the L, L, come on, man, yeah, I don't took a hold down, where to kill me. So, Eric Holder was not a lone actor in that. If you go back and follow the detail, <coughs> Nip and Big U got into it. Big U hit Nip Daddy across the head with a bat. His brother had to come out and shoot the gun. Hey, y'all get out. Say, Nip, come on, nigga. We finna come beat you. Because I don't want to pay that $20,000. You say it's over this. Like what? Nigga, only, you only was either laughing because you, two things. You was either going to put the work in, get, the, get this nigga knocked off yourself, or, God damn it, you had something to do with it. You know, he's locked up, so you didn't not get him knocked out for none of that. So, nigga, hold this on. This big you are here. Yeah. You're not going to tell me which way, though. Yeah, my mama broke you with Justice for death. <laughs> so, like, well, it's hey. two different things. He could be trolling. Right. Because, you know, they had beef. And mm -hmm. then, you know, you know how it right. is with the 40s and the 60s. You know, that, that Kelly stuff, that politics. I don't want to talk too much about their politics. But what I can say is, oh, though, he could be trolling. Go on. You know what I'm saying? Or he could be just, you know, talking about some <coughs> shit that, that, uh, shit, they can feel like, nigga. I feel like it's an inside play on Nip anyway. That whole shit was an inside play. And, you know, after a while, a hit dog on holler, nigga gonna show that hand, you know what I'm saying? Right. Especially if a nigga feel like, it's it's a cold case on so I mean you already got that nigga so why well, not nah, they locked old boy yeah they got old boy yeah, so they, they, they got sixty huh what how many they gave him sixty I forgot how many they gave him Eric Holder yeah Eric Holder you know what I'm saying they locked him up but uh, Black Sam had did an interview I saw that last night yeah you know what I'm saying so I was trying to see what was your thoughts on how Big Sam indirectly involved Big U you know what I'm saying from the rolling sixties and the you know, the unalive and the uh, Nipsey Hussle by yeah. paying for the hit. Yeah, because you were 40. And uh, what, I, what I think, uh, I think Sam, he owns something right there. Right. Because that shit just that's, ain't real like that. Right. And then, you know, that's an old school way of how a nigga used to do stuff anyway. You know, you finna go to the enemy hood, you gotta put that other color on. You know, some back in the day shit, you know, Cali, they, got just, they still on that shit. <laughs> Man, yeah, they still on that. So hey, it was, it, he was telling it in so many ways, you know what I'm saying? And he was trying to really be careful from walking that water and telling it, you know, I, I think that the interview he had with Big Boy TV, that was mm -hmm. a powerful interview. It took five years. It was five years, That's you know crazy. what I'm saying? And then he told this side of the story. It's just like. That's great. That's just like Keefy D, nigga. Yeah, the Keefy D. My, that, my pop. Yeah, my pop, yeah. That shit sound crazy, but I can't believe that nigga. I sure he keeps saying Puffy. Yeah. But John Tucker gave or gave him a million dollars. And you know, did. Puffy, that he was he showed us that was his car that Usher was in when Puffy was promoting Usher at that right. time. That, that black and that, that uh the, the Impala. Mm hmm And he was like he he asked every time they come to LA he has to use this shit, you know. That's believable because Brooklyn niggas, you know, out that way, they loces out there. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? On some New York shit. Mm -hmm.